A lot to talk about in the forecast. Hi, I'm meteorologist Dave Huffy. Hope you're having a great day. A few light showers out there. Otherwise, just cloudy skies. Temperatures did take a little hit because of all the sun filtering and onshore flow. But you can see folks out at Avila Beach. Seven day forecast is dropped in at the bottom of your screen. 10 day forecast hourly forecast, all kinds of weather available on the KSBY microclimate weather app for free. And it's not just a local app. It works everywhere. OK, light showers everywhere across the West, including higher elevation snows. The radar does show a little bit of activity scraping across the area right now. But again, we will see diminishing activity and wow, to call it activity is kind of a stretch right now. Just a few light showers here and there. Big story today elsewhere out here in parts of Georgia, some thunderstorms pop popped up caused suspension of play at the Masters, so they're not even done with round two yet. And this is going to be kind of a mess over the weekend. Continues to rain in Houston. This is the third straight day, and there's a lot of flooding going on here. So what's going to happen Saturday? We saw temperatures in the mid 80s here in Georgia. It's going to drop into the 50s for high temperatures as we get into late Saturday and Sunday. And I don't know if they're going to be able to play tomorrow. It looks pretty tough. OK, take a look at this. This is our weather pattern here. Cold front dissipating as we speak, but Saturday is a transitional day. High pressure does start to build in. We're going to start to warm, but by Sunday we're really going to see temperatures begin to pop because of the pretty significant ridge here and some 70s and meeting some low 80s are possible. Deeper extended forecast looks drier than average and now either average or slightly warmer than average. I talk about all of this flip flopping on my story on KSBY.com right now. You can see some of the temperatures for Saturday. Not bad, mid 60s to upper 60s. Pass the Robles in the interior, probably the best chance of being warm. So you're looking at some temperatures scattered low 70s. And again, we could jump up to 10 degrees for Sunday. Is Saturday the beach day? Well, I know a lot of folks are going to be around, so the answer is probably yes. You're going to go whether or not I tell you it's going to be 60 or not. But again, Sunday does look to be the warmer of the two days. Monday still holding on to good temperatures, and then we start to see the fade, especially mid to late next week when temperatures go back to below average.